Hey G-Squad, welcome back to the episode of Is It Worth It? So for today's episode, we got this cool amazing right here and basically what this is, is a wall charger. If you see the one that we got right here from this band right here and this is what the product looks like. So pretty much what's included on here is the USB-A and USB-C option. And for the plug out right here, it is a foldable design. So that way it can save a lot of space when you guys bring it along with you guys. And see in the bottom right here, this is what they call the product. They call it the Super C Pro Quick Charger. And then on the side right here, we see they probably got some more specs about the product as well. But first, they actually open up to show you guys what the product looks like inside. So first thing inside right here, they probably got a very cute sticker. If you guys want to stick this onto your stuff. Next to right here, you see they probably got a user manual to teach you guys how to use it. And then last but not least, we do have the actual part right here. You can see it's very tiny, but let's take it out first. All right. So once you guys take out the product, this special looks right here. So they do have a little wrapper here as well, but let's take it out. All right. So once you guys take it out, this is what the product looks like. So we do have the brand logo on the side right here. And right here, they mentioned how it's 30 watts with a Super C technology. And here's some more specs and features that's on the product right here as well. And right here, we see we do have a foldable plug outlet. So when you guys are ready to use it, you have to push it out like this. And that way, you plug it in the wall outlet. And then once you guys are done, you have to push it back in. And this is what the product looks like in the front. So we do have a USB-C option and a USB option as well. And supposedly, the maximum charge for the USB-C option is 18 watts. Whereas for this one right here, for the USB-A option, it's 12 watts. But you definitely plug in two cables at the same time and use both of them at the same time if you guys want to. And in terms of the product right here, they mentioned how there's a brand new technology called a Super C technology. So that way, I should help you guys cool down the charger even faster. But definitely see the product right here is super small and compact. So that way, you can bring it with you guys anywhere and use it anytime, especially when you guys are traveling. And also, supposedly for the product right here, they mentioned how it has all the protection on here in terms of over voltage protection, over charge protection, and the list goes on. And also, one thing that I mentioned is right here, if you guys look very carefully, there is an indicator light to show you guys when the product is on or off. And for the one that we got right here, it is a black color, but they do have this available in white as well. So you definitely want to do your own research to see which one to prefer. But that is everything that's on the power here. Let me just go plug it in to test it out to show you guys how it works and where the it actually works first. And then we'll come back and talk more about it in a second. All right, so right here, I do have the product. So first thing I do is to open up the plug outlet right here first. Once you do that, you're gonna plug it into the outlet. Once you have it plugged in, you can see the indicator right there, it pops on. So that is how you guys know that it's working. So what I'm doing now is to plug in the cable and test it out. So first one, we're gonna plug in the USB-C option first. All right. So we have it plugged in right here. And currently I'm using the anchor cable with a power line flow, USB-C to lightning cable. And we're gonna plug that onto our iPhone right here. All right, so you see it definitely does work. And the way how you get the fastest charge speed on here is when your percentage is low, somewhere around like 10%, 20%, basically the lower it is, the faster it can charge. Now let's test out the USB option as well. So we're gonna plug it in right here. Once you guys have that plugged in, we we'll to plug the other side to a power bank right here. All right, so we got that plugged in as well. And we see both of them are charging. So this one right here is still charging and this one's charging as well. And the total charge that's being produced on here is 30 watts maximum. It does not go above that. So if you guys do want something stronger, there's other ones available. But this one right here, the maximum is 30 watts. All right, welcome back guys. So nice little quick test the product definitely actually does work and should work quite well. So obviously in order for you guys to get the fastest charge speed on here, the battery percentage on your device need to be low, around like 10%, 20%. Basically the lower it is, the faster it can charge. But if your battery percentage is over like 80% or 90%, it will not charge as fast. But I've been seeing from the test, the product definitely does work. So that is everything that's on the power right here. Now to unboxing and testing the product, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth or not. So for the power right here, I would definitely have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want one of these one of these. Especially if you guys are trying to look for a high quality wall charger. Whereas if you guys have a USB-A option and also USB-C option as well, then I would definitely have to say that it is pretty worth it. But then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that should be doing it. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.